and the band Bridgeman has no intention of being a mere stepping stone for Lee on his way up the ladder. Jason McKay square up for the right to be crowned Ireland's super middleweight king here at the National Stadium tonight. Before that, another Irish title will be on the line as Eugene Hagney and Colin Moffat resume hostilities for the country's bantamweight crown. Good evening, welcome to the National Stadium here in Dublin. What should be a gripping Ladbrokes.com sponsored fight night here. And Mick Dowling and Jim Rock join me again. Lads, good to see you a week after our great night in Belfast. But tonight, Mick, all about Andy Lee, and he's back in the National Stadium in Dublin. Yeah, well, National Stadium here on big fight night, it's always very, very good. The stadium is, uh, you know, it's the ideal place. It's the home of boxing, in particular amateur boxing. But uh, for Andy Lee, at last, he's got an opportunity now to uh, top the bill here. And I think uh, it's going to be a real exciting night. I know a lot of people have travelled, uh, especially from Limerick, of yeah. course, but uh, against Jason McKay, it's not going to be easy. This guy is, is a 30-year-old. He's uh, been around the block. He knows what he wants. This is his opportunity, and Andy Lee can't afford himself to lose it. Jim, this title, the Irish Super Middleweight Championship, was yours until recently. Yeah, that's right. I won the title here in the stadium in uh, March 2000, and I defended it, I think, in 2005 here. Um, great title to have, yeah. but it's time to just <laughs> let go of let go of things. Basically, <laughs> Mick keeps yeah. saying I'm getting too old. <laughs> <laughs> don't mind them, don't mind them. But who's going to be leaving here with the belt tonight? Uh, Lee is the favourite, unbeaten in 13 professional fights. Great trainer Manny Stewart says he's going to be world champion by the end of next year. Yeah, I mean Lee. All the talk is about Lee, so all the pressures on Lee. McKay, I've trained with McKay for the last few years, and I have to say, like he has a bit of everything. He's very, t he's as tall as Lee, if not taller. He's awkward. He's got a good dig, he's got a good chin, and I think he's going to give Lee um, a real good run for his money, and I think he'll, he'll upset the odds here. I think Sandy Claus will be coming to Jason McKay tonight. Really? You think he'll beat him? I think Jason McKay will beat him. No, I'm biased, obviously. Okay, fair enough. But, you know, that's in all honesty. But I do think that he has the tools to certainly upset Lee, break his rhythm, and maybe he's more experienced. Okay guys, thanks a lot. We've an awful lot to look forward to and indeed a lot to talk about over the next while. We're going to have some live boxing for you coming up next after this commercial break. We've live coverage of the first title fight of the night. Eugene Hagney and Colin Moffat square up for the Irish bantamweight belt. That's the scene in the dressing room and that fight is next. <laughs> 